Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another recap of Baddies East, episode 8, Someone Came With Baggage. So as y'all know, if y'all been keeping up with the show, Roly and T gets into it. Because Roly feels as if nobody can't come to her and check her. So T, mind you, as sick as she was, she stood her ground and she fought. So basically she had a triple, triple decker sandwich. She had Scarface. Scotty and Roly, all within five minutes of each other. Like, what? Sis, sick and all, she held her own. Like, one thing about her, she gonna stand ten toes down for herself, whether nobody's by her side or not. So, eventually, Natalie goes out to talk to her and basically gets to see where her head is at, stuff like that. So, eventually, T said, listen, I ain't got time for y'all. I'll fake y'all some haters. And I hate when Natalie do this. Like, she tried to play both sides of the field. Like, you already know what the heck was going on. You just, not, you just saw her get beat by them three girls. Like, what the heck? You know when it's 520 Mariah with her home, her, um, her confession? She was like, like, fought this girl that was three times her size. And she was like, so she fought six bitches. Like, what in the world? I mean, Rolly at this time, yeah, she was big. So, yeah, it's like she was fighting six people by herself. Mind you, that that was too much. So Scotty is still in the bathroom. Um, Scarface is still with her in the bathroom. And I was checking on her face stuff like that. So Scotty, not Scotty, Natalie and T is outside walking and whatever. And T was like, she's leaving. She ordered her a car so they could come pick her up and whatnot. And they're still just talking and whatnot. Um, Natalie thought it was best that T go inside so she can, you know, get both sides of the story, see where the heads at. First, she was like, yeah, that's cool, but nah, it just went left. Next thing you know, Suki and her friend Sapphire pull up. They're the new ones to join the cast of the show. I love me so Suki, too. Like, oh, my God, she's a mood. She's a vibe. And I love that she just gives back to, like, her community and stuff like that in good ways. Like, anyways... So they greet T and T tells them what happened. She was like, I just got into fight with three girls. I'm sick and all that. And they just basically like, listen, Suki was like, listen, I don't get I don't condone no bullying, no no, none of that stuff. Like, I got your back, I got your back. Sapphire too included. So they're all talking or whatever. T was like, listen, it was nice to meet y'all. Never, I'm just gonna go home. So meanwhile, um Mariah and and Taseki, Taseki. I'm gonna just call her Latifa, but her middle name like Chris Sean does Latifa. They were outside in front of the the um go kart place, and they walk and they up see Suki, Sapphire, and Natalie walking. Um, Latifa ends up giving Suki a hug. They go way back too, so it's just like, oh my god, like friends all over again. So they all hug it out, talk it out. Next, you know, they end up going inside the place. And they're talking about the fighting and stuff like that. And it's just like, everybody greeted each other. So it was like a good vibe. Then next, you know, Smiley pulls up to the freaking go-kart place. Like, if you just had a miscarriage, you would have sat your behind down somewhere. Like, but she was like, I was going to be a good sport and show. No, they know what happened to you. You should have been at home in bed. But she shows up. And whatever. They eventually go go-kart racing. The vibe started changing for the better. Um, but I think it was Scotty, Sapphire, Suki, Sky, and Mariah that had to wait for the other group to go. Um, meanwhile, Latifa, Roly, Scarface, and Scotty, they was playing in the arcade. Everybody was having a good time. Whatever. The vibe was good and was chill. Nobody got into no more altercations. And whatnot. So later on that day after that, Suki had to leave because she had to show. The girls was getting ready to go to the club, Seventh Element. Everybody gets to the house. And you know, the vibes was good. Um, yeah, they eventually all pulled up to the seventh seventh element. It was so packed, like the place was small, really, really small, but it was packed. So they went in and had a good time and whatnot. Glad that nobody was fighting each other. They was turning up. They played 
Suki did her song, Mariah did her song, Rolly did her song, Anna did her song while they had to play it in the back, whatever. It was just a good time, good vibe. So now, um, Latifah and Smiley, they stay home because Latifah's legs are swollen and stuff, I guess, from that fight. And, you know, supposedly Smiley and her miscarriage or whatever. So she started going, like, back down the memory lane. Like, she started feeling sad and stuff like that. So we was like, whatever. It's still up because it's like you don't know whether to believe Smiley's telling the truth or whatnot. So it's now the next day. They start recapping about the party and everything that went down. Sky, Anna, Smiley, and Camilla there in the kitchen. They're talking. Things went good. And... Yeah, so then now it was like we're having a meeting. Next, you know, they get to the meeting, and now they was talking about the party and the girls stuff like that. They was talking about if it was T okay, or whatever. Next, you know, uh, Biggie pulls up, like Biggie and Roly get into it because. I guess Rolly's still mad or Biggie's still mad about what happened in the last episode, um, not episode season of Baddie West, where supposedly um Rolly was telling Biggie to stop picking on Stunner Girl, which at that point Rolly did tell her that, but Biggie tried to make it seem like she didn't tell her that. Yes, Rolly did tell you. I seen it. I seen it with my eyes. She told her that. So them two going back and forth next year, all the girls is just like what the heck did we just walk into a witness? Like, yeah, they were going at it multiple times. And then Biggie kept saying what she was saying in, in Spanish. And then Rolly was mocking her. It was funny because she sounded just like her. Like, <laughs> oh, my God. It was so crazy how it went down, but it went down. So, yeah, that was basically this episode, like, in a nutshell. Next week's episode, it shows, like, some more fighting going on, more drama. We finally get to see T. She got a new hairstyle. She looking cute. I'm feeling her in this purple. A lot of stuff about to happen. Uh, Smiley, she goes out to go out with them, just the girls. Um, It was so much drama to return, but, yeah, this episode was a lot to take in. But it's like, y'all probably be getting to the money. Why y'all always fight all the time? Like, put your grown woman panties on and do what you got to do. Get that money so you don't got to worry about fighting and damaging wigs. But yeah, this episode, it was, I was, it was okay. It wasn't like to my liking, but it, you know, it is what it is. So, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll see y'all the next one. Bye.